Welcome back, Monster Jam fans, to Science Series number 9. You know who I am. And this is Freestyle. Before we go any further, just wanted to say that today is September 11th. Well, the day I'm filming this. Don't know when this will be uploaded, but... So, to honor those that pass on that tragic day, we got NEA and Backdraft here. We got Cody Armstrong and NEA and Monster Jam Alex and Backdraft. So NEA is on Team Gravedigger, and Backdraft is on Team Max D. Here's the track. Change it a little bit. They got plenty of room to land. And uh, this triple stack, if they don't destroy it, I can promise you, you're going to see some pretty sick air. So let's go. Alright, first off, representing Team Max D, it is Mega Rex. Why am I looking forward to seeing this truck in real life? It looks awesome. And it will be a three from Mega Rex. Okay, so we're gonna go for the middle jump first. If you don't see any destruction, I promise you're gonna see some pretty big air. There we go. Oh! Goes right in on the van, knocks out the boat, flips it over. All right, we're off to a really good start. All right, on to the next ramp, which will be this one. And this one is called Digger's Death Toll. Designed and named by HobbyBuddy99. Go give him support on Instagram if you haven't already. And here he goes for a second hit. Oh, nice jump. Hits the Monster Energy cans and saves it. All right, one more hit to go for Mega Rex. All right, last hit. He's going for the maximum triple stack. Came up with that myself. Decided to call it that just because it's a max eight color triple stack. Replaced the middle can with one that was left over from the last science series. Because, man, they, they flattened that one. Anyways, here we go. Get ready to see some sick air. Oh, well, that was kind of anticlimactic. Well, well, this does rub against the body a little bit. That's probably what happened. Oh, yeah, yep. All right. Oh, Oh my gosh, why did I move Mega Rex? Well, we'll just put him right there. He's gonna get beat anyways. I'm sorry, that sounded really negative. I apologize for that. Anyways, next up, representing Team Gravedigger, it's Bigfoot, who got the racing win. 124 scale racing, that is. Let me know what you guys think of that, and should I do it again? Alright, it is a two for Bigfoot. All right, we're going to go for the two big cans. What's left of the mega cans from 124 scale racing. And here we go. Oh, oh wow, that was, that was perfect. Okay. Now, for hit number two, he's going for the maximum triple. Let's see if he can do better than Mega Rex did. Oh, whoa. What a save by Bigfoot. That's a little crooked. Nice air. Oh, look at that. Look at the line he let. That was awesome. That was very realistic. All right. Your new leader, Bigfoot, representing Team Gravedigger. And representing Team Max D, the one that got beaten by El Toro Loco. It's higher education. Which, which he's coming back to Monster Jam, by the way. Hagerstown, I think. And it is a 6 for higher education. All right. We are going to go for the middle first. See what this cool bus can do. Oh, kind of similar to what Mega Rex did, except didn't roll it over. All right, now for hit number two. Hit number two, he's going for Digger's Death Toll. Oh, falls off the track, nose dives into the dirt and flips it over. All right, what a bummer. But it's not the end. Okay, number three, he's going for the Mega Cans. That's what I'm calling this lane, the Mega Cans. Just calling it what it is. Oh, oh, didn't get enough speed, ended up crashing into the middle. Oh yeah, the middle all jump was designed by Hobby Buddy. He didn't say anything about this side, so he came up with that side and I came up with this side, so it was a team effort. Anyways, getting off topic here, sorry. All right, hit number four. Yeah, number four, going for the maximum triple. Oh, 
Yeah, higher education seems to have some kind of steering problem, I guess. But he's trying to overcome it. Alright, now for number five, he's going for Digger's Death Hole again. Oh, that was, that was nowhere near better. Okay, one more hit to go. Alright, for his final hit, he's going for the maximum triple again. Okay, just had to check on one of the tires. Should be good now. Here we go. Final hit. Going for the maximum triple. Oh, that was way better than his first time hitting it. it runs right into Bigfoot, but unfortunately, higher education will not get the win. All right, better luck next time. Okay, next up, your racing champion, El Toro Loco. The only time El Toro gets to go. And it is a five. Okay. Gonna go for the maximum triple first. I'll save it for last also. Wow! Yeah, I told you we'd see some cool air. Okay, hit number two. Going for Digger's Death Toll. Let's see if he can make it across. Oh! Goes off to the side, up against the wall. You see why I put those signs there? Because I realized I did it too close. Anyways. Alright, number three, going for the Mega Cans. Here we go. Oh, hits the green one, goes off to the side. Manages to keep it on all four. Not bad, not bad. But now he's got two hits left. See what he can do. Alright, for hit number four, he's going for the middle jump. We'll see what he can do. Oh, runs right into the boat. Kind of does a stoppy. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, you can see why I put those things there. Kind of had a feeling they were going to all go there. Anyways, one more hit for El Toro. Going for the maximum triple for last, like I said, because I am not full of crap. Here we go. Oh, kind of had a little trouble going down, but managed to keep it in, con in control just enough to do a nice jump. Goes off to the middle. Bigfoot, still your leader. Okay, next up, representing Team Max D is the Gold Max D. And how many times will Goldie get to go? Three. Okay. Gonna go for Digger's Death Hole first. Whoa, whoa. That was, did you see that? The way he was driving forward on two wheels? Was that like a reverse moonwalk? I don't know. Well, if anything, it's like what Son of a Digger did in Tacoma in 2015. Gosh, that was loud. It's like I had no headphones on at all. Those zoomies, man. Anyways, going for the middle. Oh, what a wreck. All right, he's got one more hit. Can he conquer the maximum triple? Well, we're about to find out, aren't we? In three, two, one. Oh, loses control going down, cartwheels it. And over on the side he goes. So Max D Gold will not get the win. Bigfoot still your leader. Who's next? All right, next up, the winner of Long Jump. It is the Monster Jam Stunt Truck. See what he got. And it is a six for the stunt truck. Okay, we are gonna go for the middle first. And here we go. Oh, front flips it, lands it on his side. See what else he can do here. Hit number two. He's, go he's going for uh, the Mega Cans. And here he goes. Oh, loses control, hitting the ramp. And off he goes. Hit number three. He's going for Digger's Death Hole. He's got the back open to get the sand out. And here he goes. Oh, that might have brought him good luck having that open. They did a pretty good job there. And uh, number four, he's going for the maximum triple. Here we go. Oh! And he did a complete front flip and managed to keep on going and run into Bigfoot. That was beautiful. Alright, now for hit number five. Can you go for the middle again? See if he has better luck on it. Whoa, what the heck? Well, that was weird, but he managed to keep it on all four. 
And because of what he did on the triple, he's going to go for it for his final hit. Here he goes. Oh! Finally somebody hit the yellow can. Look like he kind of did a, what do they call it, a flat spin in midair and then flips it over. But the stunt truck will not get the lead or win because Bigfoot is still your leader. Okay, next up. She won freestyle last time. It's Harley Quinn. See what she can do. And it is a three for Quinn. So, we are going to go for the middle jump first. Oh! Runs into the green can. Well, the car anyway, knocking it loose. And now, she's going to go for that ramp now. And here we go. Digger's Death Toll. Oh, nice air there. I fixed the ramp a little bit, made it a little bit steeper. So they can get some better air, and it looked like it worked. Now for the final hit. Going for the maximum triple. Can she make it? And here we go. Oh, what even was that? The same move Gold Max D made. And ends up on the cans. The mega cans, that is. Representing Team Gravedigger, it is Big Kahuna. I cannot wait to get the hot rod version. Oh, dice just went off on its own. And it is a two for Big Kahuna. Alright, two hits. First off, gonna go for the Digger's Death Toll. Oh, nice, nice. Now he's got one more hit. Let's see what this Chevy C10 can do. For his final hit, that is. Going for a maximum triple. And surfs up. What? What was that? That was weird. I don't know what that was. But nice save, though. But sadly, it won't get in the win. Bigfoot, still your leader. And up next, representing Team Max D, it is Earthshaker. And it's also a two for Earthshaker. Okay, gonna go for the middle jump this time. Oh, but he wanted to go for the cans, the mega cans. So, epic fail there. One more hit to go. He's gonna go for the maximum triple. Let's see... If he can shake things up here. Oh! Earthshaker just all over the place. But unfortunately, he will not get the win over Bigfoot. Okay, next up, representing Team Gravedigger, it is Zombie, breaking world record. And it's going to be a one for Zombie. And he's going to go for the maximum triple. And here we go. Oh, nice jump. Did a front flip or two. And flips it over on his side. But Bigfoot is still your leader. Okay, representing Team Max D. It is the Blackout Max D. And it is a three for Max D. And that rhymed. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Gonna go for a Digger's Dungeon. Or... Digger's death toll first. Oh, lose control going down. What is it about the side that makes them lose control? I really don't get it. I swear I'm not sabotaging certain trucks. That's just how it is there. It's the curse side, I guess. Anyways, for his next hit, he's going for the middle jump. Oh, perfectly done. Now he's got one more hit. Going for the maximum triple. Can he make it? Here we go. The triple. Oh, kind of a try to do a sky wheelie. Lands it on the tailgate and on his side. Bigfoot still your leader. Will Bigfoot double down? Will Gravedigger conquer this science series for good? Oof. And speaking of Team Gravedigger, here comes the Black Pearl, who is on Team Gravedigger. And it's going to be a one for the Black Pearl Monster Truck. Going for the maximum triple. Can he make it? Oh, nicely done. 
And he will not get the lead, though. Good jump, though. Um, I'm really loving how this triple stack turned out. I need to use that ramp more often. Okay, next up, representing Team Max D, it is Maximum Destruction. Retro Rebels. Monster Jam Follower 03 requested to be in Maximum Destruction. He... He didn't want to be in Max D, he wanted to be in the OG Maximum Destruction, so here he is. Got two of them here. And it's going to be a four for Maximum Destruction. I'm going to go for Digger's Dust Hole first. Can he make it? Oh! Nice jump by Max D. Nice crash. Okay, hit number two. He's going for the middle jump. Here we go. Oh, oh, wow, nice jump, perfect landing. All right, see what else he can do. Hit number three, going for the Mega Cans. Can he clear them or crush them? What's left of them? And he does, he clears them, yep. All right, one more hit to go for Max Destruction. And he's going for the maximum triple. Can he make it? In three, two, one. Oh! What a leap! And we have a new leader. Maximum destruction! And representing Team Gravedigger, it is Jurassic Attack. And it is a one for Jurassic Attack. Going to go for the maximum triple. Can he beat Max D? No, he will not. As he goes out of bounds, this time I put the mat down because usually they go off off the track when they go on the triple stack. So yeah, Jurassic Attack not getting the win. And up next, it is Max D Fire. Let's see how many times this guy gets to go. And it is a six for Max D Fire. And he's going to go for Digger's Death Toll first. So here he goes. Oh! Maybe I should have put that green cane a little closer. Hit number two. He's going to go for the Mega Cans. And here we go. Oh! Hit some, front flips it, and tries to go to the end. Not quite yet. Number three, going for the middle jump. Oh, Ooh, I got a good feeling about Max D Fire. Number four, he's going for the maximum triple. And here we go. Oh, lose control. What a fail. Now for hit number five, he's going to go for the middle jump again. And here we go. All right. Now he's got one more hit to go. And he's going to go for the maximum triple one more time. Can he make it this time, or will he repeat himself? Alright, that was way better, and he comes close to the end. But Max D. Fire will not get the win. Maximum Destruction, still your leader. Okay, next up, representing Team Gravedigger, is Gravedigger, Fire and Ice. Here we go. Oh, come on, where'd it go? And it is a five. It is a five for Gravedigger Fire and Ice. Let me just. Okay, there you go. So I can keep track of it. And here we go. Triple first. Whoa! Cartwheels it in the air. That was crazy. Alright, not bad for his first hit. He's going out in style. Alright, hit number two. He's going for the Mega Cans. Here we go. Oh, what a rollover for Grave Digger. Number three, he's going for the middle jump. I fixed the ramp a little bit, or changed it up at least. See if it works. Whoa, nice air by Grave Digger. And for number four, he's going for Digger's Death Toll. Whoa, oh, I got that ramp working now. And one more hit to go. He's going for the triple one more time. See if he can do better. Oh! 
That was insane. But the only problem is he bounced off the wall, so he could have gotten the lead over Max D, but he didn't. But that was pretty impressive, though. So Max D is still your leader. Okay, next up, representing Team Max D, it is the 909. See what he can do. And it is a one for the 909, so here we go. Oh, uh, uh, uh oh. And we have a new leader, the 909. And up next, it is the beautiful Green Ghost Gravedigger, who's renting OCD Meltdown's chassis, and boy does it look good, don't you think? And somebody else on Facebook did it too. Great minds think alike, am I right? And it is a three for the Grave Digger. Alright, gonna go for Digger's Death Toll. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Hit number two, we're going for the middle jump. When I was testing the middle jump, I used Green Ghost Grave Digger and he flew. That's why I put those two cans there, because that's where he landed. See if we can hit him again. Nope. Good jump, though. Well, now he's got one more hit to go. Can he beat the 909? Well, we're about to find out. As he goes for the triple. In three, two, one. Oh, what the crap was that? That sucked. Oh, well, Green Ghost will not get the win. The 909 is still your leader. And coming up next, it's... The Inverse Bro Dozer. I don't want to get the dice. And how many times will you get go? I'm just going to yeet it. And it is a three for the Bro Dozer. Okay, going for you know what. Oh, tough landing for Bro Dozer. Going for the middle jump. Oh, oh, nice. That was a realistic jump. And one more hit to go. He's going for the maximum triple. Can he make it? Here we go. Oh! Nice jump. Lands right there. Goes out of bounds. So he will not get the win over the 909. Okay, next up. The Monster Lobster. Crush Station. Roar. And it is a 6 for the Roar Crush Station. That was weird. Hit number one, here he goes. Oh, and there he goes doing the lobster roll. Number two, going for the triple. Whoa, looks like he kind of did a backflip in the air. Well, half one before landing on his roof and bouncing back up. That was nice. Hit number two, going for the mega cans. And there he goes doing the lobster roll again. That uh, is his signature move. Hit number four. Yeah, yeah, four. Going for the middle jump. Oh, nicely done. Now for number five. Let's see. Hmm. I think he's going to go for Digger's Death Hole again. Yep, let's do it. Mm hmm. And here we go. Oh, off to the side after hitting the Monster Energy cans. And one more hit to go. He's going for the triple one more time. Doge. Oh. Okay, I'm sorry about that. A freaking wasp came flying at me. And uh, I do not like those things. They've been coming in here and bugging me all summer. Fall can't come any sooner. Well, now... Well, now you got something funny to laugh at in this video. Alright. Who's next? And up next, representing Max D, is Max D Red. And it is a four for Max D Red. So here we go. Going for Digger's Death Hole. Oh, man, just stay on all four and lands right on the van. Beautiful. Alright, number two, he's going for the middle jump. Can he clear it all or crush everything? Whoa! Kind of went for a sky wheelie there, and over he goes. 
Hit number three. Yep, going for the Mega Cans. Oh, I may need to fix that ramp a little. And for his final hit, he's going for the Maximum Triple. Here we go. Oh, kind of does a little weird flip in the air and then lands it on his roof. Sadly, Max D will not get the win. The 909 is still your leader. All right, next up, it's a blast from the past. The Grandma Gravedigger. I can't wait to get the singles pack version. Series, is it Series 20? Or is, yeah, Series 20, I think. I don't know, I'm getting confused now. Here we go. Oh, oh. All right, and it is a five. And why is the camera blurry? There we go. Anywho, first off, going for the middle jump. Oh, the same move Max D made. What a fail. Okay, hit number two. I'm going for the Mega Cans. I fixed the ramp. See if it works. And it works. And nice save by Gravedigger. Beautifully done. And for hit number three, going for Digger's Death Toll. Oh! Almost goes across, but nosedives it right into the side of that ramp. Ouch. Hit number five, or four, I mean, excuse me. He's going for the middle jump again. See if he can do better. Oh, that was way better. Way better. And he's got one more hit to go. You know what he's going for. If you've been watching me for as long as you have, then you know where this is going. The maximum triple stack, of course. Here he goes for his final hit. Oh! Takes out the yellow can, flips it over, and lands it on the tailgate. Or the back doors, whatever. Gravedigger Grandma will not get the win.